Well before construction begins on any major roadway, engineers study the area to make sure that the proposed designs and concepts for the new roadway are feasible and what is designed to be built can indeed be built. The engineers conduct geotechnical investigations. This means they study the rocks, ground elevation, water table, and soil that will be under the roadway. They also look at locations where new stormwater retention ponds can be placed to handle increased runoff. Where there's a lot of pavement, like on the I-4 Ultimate project, ponds must be designed to remove oil, grease, and sediment from the runoff, and the runoff must be as clean as the body of water it's going into. This is how it's done. Storm water runs into the pond where pollutants settle to the bottom, allowing clean water to drain from the top of the pond into nearby lakes and rivers. It may also seep into the groundwater. The plans for the I-4 Ultimate project include many new stormwater ponds. The new ponds are designed to ensure that the roadway rainwater is collected in the drainage system before being discharged into a natural body of water. The full drainage system, including the ponds, retain and detain the water. This process allows for the removal of impurities, recharging of the groundwater, and it also protects the natural body of water from surcharge of drain water. Stay informed about the project by logging onto i4ultimate.com. The website has information about the entire 21-mile corridor and what changes are being made. You can also sign up for route-specific email and text alerts and our monthly e-newsletter.